I'm at the Dell booth at MWC in 2024. Uh, I'm working, we, we are working on a CASA, uh, Intel Infrastructure Power Manager integrated into the CASA user plane function. CASA systems, Intel and Dell have joined together to provide this demo. Um, CASA systems builds fully cloud native 4G and 5G packet core components. This demo is about runtime power management and power management becomes extremely critical, especially in 5G use cases that are highly throughput intensive. Most operators are kind of saturated on the subscribers, but the per subscriber throughput is increasing, right? Driven primarily by many use cases that are video intensive, audio intensive, and virtual and augmented reality intensive use cases. So power management becomes extremely critical in this kind of a situation. Um, in this demo, what we are going to do is, we have integrated the Intel infrastructure power management solution into the CASA user plane function or the UPF. Uh, and we have taken a real life uh, service provider call model, right? And then run this demo. As you know, uh, for a service provider, the traffic is not a constant throughout the entire 24 hour day period. There are busy hours and there are many lean hours, right? But the power consumption remains a constant even if there is not much of a throughput across the UPF. With IPM, we are able to manage it and bring it down, right? That is the core uh, essence of this demo. So in this slide, what, what we are showing is how the system behaves without the IPM enabled. There are two CPUs on the Dell 760 server that we have uh, used the demo, uh, to run the demo. On CPU zero, we are deliberately not pushing any traffic just to show what the power consumption is. The power consumption is about 150 watts. In CPU one is where all the user plane functions start pro process the packets. And the power consumption runs up to 300 watts, right? Even if there is just very little throughput. Uh, in this scenario, we are uh, pushing about 15 million packets per second, leading to 174 GBPS, and that consumes 300 watts. In the next slide, what we are showing is how IPM uh, enables us to manage the runtime power, right? Again, in this uh, scenario too, the CPU zero, there is no packet processing. All the packet processing is happening in CPU one. And as you can see in this uh, demo, at, at 256 GBPS, the power consumption is about 300 watts. And about 128 GBPS, it comes down to 275 watts and at 64 GBPS, it comes down all the way down to 150 watts, right? So depending upon the throughput, the power consumption goes down. So in the previous case, you can see the, uh, if you look at the uh, graph here, the power consumption across both the CPUs remains more or less a constant 450, but here with IPM, the power consumption varies, right? Depending upon the throughput, when there is not much of a throughput, it goes down, and along when throughput increases, the power consumption goes up, right? So you can see how it varies across the busy hour and not so busy hour periods during the entire day. So net net, what we have seen is the power consumption goes down approximately 28.82% for this particular call model per CPU per year, right? And when you look at a data center, typically with uh, hundreds of servers, this leads to significant power savings, right? And that leads to a lower cost of ownership, lower operational cost, and most importantly, lower carbon footprint, right? Leading us to a more sustainable solution. For more information about CASA system, please go to casa-systems.com. For more information on the Intel Infrastructure Power Manager, go to intel.com. And for more information on the Dell 760 servers and the suite of servers that Dell has, please go to dell.com. Thank you so much.